In the Trenches, sponsored by Wade Incorporated, the Orthopedic Institute, and Southern Housing. Look up 5A state championship in the dictionary. You see these guys. For the past six years, they've been in the title game. But for the last two, they've come up short. Now they're trying to get back to the mountaintop and win it all again. Let's get in the trenches with the West Point Green Wave. Then last year, come up short like that in the state championship game, coming off a of 11 0 streak. Uh, honestly, it hurt. It hurt a lot of us. We work hard all offseason. Only in West Point do you consider a state championship appearance and an 11 and 1 record a down year. But that's the standard for Keyshawn Henley and the Green Wave. We got to halftime, and I feel like we just got down on ourselves. We didn't come out with the right attitude. But um, this year is going to be different. We're going to fight to the end. Head coach Chris Chambliss has always told me that the wave will only go as far as its seniors will take them. Well, this year, he's got a lot of seniors. And so far, they're showing coach that they've got what it takes. The guys have done a really good job of leading and supporting each other and being here. And, and uh, we've had great participation in the summer workouts. And, of course, we don't expect anything less than that. And that's what you got to have to kind of have that recipe to, to give yourself a chance to win. I'm sure the Wave are cooking up another deep playoff run. But for right now, let's see if they have the recipe to survive the Fast Five. Jamal Adams. Got to get to Marshawn Lynch. Hill State. Hill State. All in. By who? The baby. I just, I just built my own world. But I really like episodes, all American. Um, blackface. Uh, Alfredo. Pasta Alfredo? Yeah, that's good. Oatmeal. Oatmeal? Wow. <laughs>